Introducing two young athletes from Winter, South Dakota. A promising figure skater and an up-and-coming hockey player. A hockey player with a few too many hits to the head. Give it to me straight, Doc. You know how when you play hockey you use your eyes to see things and move around? You can't do that anymore. Cut the technical mumbo jumbo. You're blind. In English, Doc! You're blind, you goddamn retired hockey player! Son of a bitch! And a tragic accident with patio furniture. <laughs> Fate has a way of making things happen. You're blind, and you're blind. You guys are gonna skate together, I'm gonna coach you, and a story! But will they be good enough to defeat the returning champions? I don't understand why you can't just crown me the champion of icicles, Daddy. You have to win it, boy. I don't raise losers. Walcott, technically you have to compete in order to be a winner. Shut up, Regina. It's pointless! And cruel! Not trying is pointless and cruel! Not trying is wondering your whole life if you gave up too soon! I'm just a tomato! A blind tomato! Shut up! And no one's gonna blame a blind, helpless tomato for giving up! I sure hope not. a chance to be somebody. She is somebody! Ah! Ah! Regina, I know we're skating partners, but I find myself very attracted to you. Let's keep this professional. If you want to be professional, why don't you start sticking your jumps, Regina? I have 99.99 .99 repeating percentile accuracy. Yeah, well, you're being about 99.9% annoying right now. It will take a lot of courage. It will take a lot of strength. But most of all, it will take a lot of love. I still hate you. I hate you more. I hate you more, Infinity. Damn it. This is the story of two athletes who refuse to forget that everyone needs to be a champion. Icicles, the last chance of a lifetime.